today I'm going to be telling you everything you need to know about the new Rogue Citizens update coming soon. Uh, a lot of things are going to be coming, so that's basically what I'm going to be explaining right now. First things first, let's start from the top. I already made a video about this, but a lot more has came, like a lot more news about the new update has risen. So right now, I'm just going to go over everything, even if I've done an episode on it already. So first, new emotes. So you can actually post suggestions. I don't know if they're still taking any suggestions, but if you do, just check out this tweet right here and just leave any comment that, you know, leave whatever emote you want. The current emotes that we know about that are going to be new are salute your captain, intimidate your enemies, and carry your friends. So you literally might be able to carry your friends around the map. And I'm kind of excited to see, like, you know, can you carry somebody in a car? Or, like, you know, how does, how does that work, you know? There's also going to be a new UI and hotkey system for gamepad and PC users to easily select emotes they use a lot. So, you know, I didn't even know... I don't think they even had hotkeys, but I don't even know for sure, like, if they have hotkeys in the game as of right now. But, hey, they said they're coming out with a hotkey system where you can just throw your emotes in, and then you can just use, you know, your favorite emotes. So, good to know. Now, this right here is probably going to be the biggest thing in the update. It is the bank vault is getting an upgrade. So, for, for robbing the vault... There's going to be a, a huge upgrade. There's actually a 14 second video right here that we are going to watch. And basically just shows. You see the little timer right there. Bam. Alright. So I think there's like there's just going to be a huge, huge update. I know the quality is not good on this. But there's going to be a pretty huge update coming to the bank vault. So that might involve me either opening up a uh, private server. Or going into a public server and robbing this vault in the near future and as you can see right here it says random layout generation there are over 20 combinations of possible vault interiors okay safes that require more than one lockpick to open tackle these with friends loot carts that don't require any tools to steal okay so those are three things that uh, we at least know now about this update so you know that's actually kind of interesting there will be over 20 combinations of possible vault interiors. So when you break in the first time, you break in a second time, third time, they could all be completely different, which means you're set to have to do more and more and more. Like, or you can't, like when you do, you do wrap the bank, it won't just be super easy, you know what I'm saying? Because you're going to have to, because it's going to all be different every single time, or at least not every single time. If you do it 20 times and then you at least get like 21 times, you'll at least have one that is different you know now for the next thing as you can see the police station right here you can see the nice photos it is getting an upgrade so you look through here it's going to be uh, you know added a lot more detail into this why we need to eat less donuts well that's a great question and you know what if this is a uh, an assembly thing honestly I would go to it but this you know police station is getting some brand new upgrades next update so these are nice cool new areas in the uh, police station so now as you can see right here a sneak peek of another feature coming to the next update interaction pose variants you can see look at how clean that looks hold on let's let's do a little pause right here look at how clean this interface looks so you can do so you can change your sleeping position you know look at that you can change up to I think f three sleeping positions here. Like, that's crazy. That's actually crazy. Because, you know, they haven't done this at all in a long time. So look, bam, that side, that side. And you can just do regular. I mean, it's it's a small, small design. But the fact that you can just, you can customize it literally how you sleep. It's kind of crazy. But as you can see, those are the primary things coming the next update this honestly might be one of my favorite like in design likes like in some sort of design aspect like it might be one of my favorites but i mean obviously like because i don't really go into the police station that much but this is cool um and here this is not like design wise i haven't really seen too much design you know once we get like the 20 different vault interiors maybe it'll end up being my favorite but for now 
I think those are all the things that are coming to the next update. And when will the next update come out? Um, I'm assuming it'll be sometime next week. Maybe end the week next week. Leading into early the week after. I'm, I'm assuming. But, you know, I guess we'll see. But other than that, though, that's it for this little quick walkthrough of New Rose Citizens updates coming to the next one. And, uh, yeah, I'm out.